Hello, welcome to my review show. So tonight we are heading to Tim Hortons because their new hockey cards are out again. And every year they come out around this time. And uh, I'm also going to try their new uh, dark roast coffee. It says it's bolder, richer, darker. Well, let's see if it's any good. Let's go. All right, back out of that rain and uh, got my nice Tim Hortons steaming cup of coffee. Uh, dark roast and apparently it's bolder, darker, and um, bolder, darker, and richer, probably. Um, let's give it a try. I get it with almond milk. Um, yeah, I uh, believe they changed the dark roast quite some time ago, and it was better than the original one. Um, so now I'm seeing advertising them doing it again, changing it. Let's see if it's any different. Tastes the same to me. The dark roast is definitely better than the original. No, I'll go with that. Um, so really, I just got this because uh, their hockey cards are back. Here we are, Tim Hortons, Upper Deck. Um, hockey cards, 2021-22 season packs are now out. Um, if you buy a beverage, you can get uh, one pack for 99 cents. Uh, otherwise, uh, they're $1.99 each. Um, $1.99 is not too bad, but you do only get, I think it's the same this year, uh, only like three cards in a pack. Um, so uh, usually I buy them um, each year. My son's into buying them now and collecting them. So uh, this is pretty good, the Dark Roast. Take another swing of that. So I'm just gonna go quick review here of um, what they look like and um, yeah, see if I'm gonna open them. I haven't opened them yet. They're still sealed. Just got them at Tim Hortons tonight and um, see if I got anything in them. Uh, you can get special cards. You can, I think you can even win a meet and greet with Sidney Crosby, uh, which would be awesome. Um, but there's like inserts in here. So I believe it's uh, every uh, let's see here, one in five packs. It's hard to read this, but there's um, certain specialty cards you can get that are, are obviously worth more than the regular cards. But um, yeah, let's uh, crack them open and see if I got um, some rare card or exactly what they look like. Let's go. Okay, so we'll start with our first pack. So as you can see, Upper Deck Tim Hortons NHL Trading Cards 2021-22 Collectors Series. Sidney Crosby on the front of the package. And it says, New, find a golden collect to win prize card for a chance to win a prize. So I think they have like prize cards you can win in here for even uh, possibly maybe Tim Horton. Um products like food and stuff and gift cards possibly all right so here we go we're opening it up live well it's not really live but anyway let's see what they look like this year all right look at those that is some flashy looking cards they're usually pretty nice looking upper deck makes the best looking cards and tim hortons does uh, pretty good as well it looks like i got an insert here look at that Steven Stamkos holding up the Stanley Cup photo finish. All right. And we got a Toronto Maple Leaf Morgan Riley. Regular. So that's a nice looking card. You always know the inserts when they're not a regular number they have. So it's PF9, so photo finish 9. So uh, any Stamkos or Tampa Bay Lightning fans out there, let me know. That's a nice card. All right. Well, I didn't win too much there. And we'll just open up this one here. Let me know in the comments below if you collect Tim Hortons cards, hockey cards, sports cards in general. Kirill Kaprizov, he was the Rookie of the Year in 2021. And I got an insert here. Ooh, another Tampa Bay, Andre Vasilevsky. I may be screwing up some of these names, but uh, this is a red card. So that is an insert. 
and Josh Norris for the Ottawa Senators. So, uh, yeah, pretty nice looking cards again this year from uh, Tim Hortons. And um, as you uh, may know, in one of my other videos, I pulled out uh, my old uh, sports cards from when I was uh, younger and uh, found some special cards, uh, even a Kobe Bryant rookie. Um, but I don't collect cards too much anymore. Um, but uh, Tim Hortons comes out. I usually like to get some once in a while. And uh, once again, Tim Hortons cards uh, give a good 8 out of 10. They are... Uh, Nice looking, shiny cards, upper deck, and um, you got all your stats on the back. So you can collect the regular series, and then you can try to get inserts or maybe prizes uh, this year. So, uh, yeah, the uh, coffee's good. Uh, dark Roast I would go with, not the original. Um, but um, really here to review the Tim Hortons cards. And, um, yeah, go grab yourself a pack um, before they're gone. All right, that's it for this uh, episode of my review show. We'll check you out on the next one. Uh, please like, subscribe, and share. And uh, thanks so much, and we'll see you again soon.